Yes, yeah, Julian Newick. I'm the owner of the Lifeboat Ale and Cider House at, uh, in Market Street. Perfect. Thanks. Thank you very much. Cheers. Cheers. Charity shops are, are, are okay. A number, a couple. You know, one in ten, not, not five in ten. Yeah, I'd, but that, but you know what? They, even when my father was the manager of the Marks and Spencer in Margaret High yeah. Street for 25 years, don't record this. Yes. And um, <laughs> there was a charity shop next door to Marks and Spencer for all of that time. There was indeed. That, yeah. You know, yeah. so this is not something that's new. Well, it's not new. It was never no, particularly no, no. brilliant in those days. And it's not particularly better now, but no. but it's not. It's kind of a tradition that we've got yeah. in a way. Mm. The only place you don't get charity shops is uh, in in out of town shopping centres. Mm. No, you know. Absolutely. Anyway, right. there you go, guys. They can't, they can't afford the uh, the rent. <laughs> That's right. Okay. Uh, the first question: uh, what, uh, what do you think of Margate as a whole, and why? Um, what do I think of Margate as a whole? Well, I mean, I grew up in Margate. I went to school in Margate. Um, Margate is um, part of me. It's in my blood. I believe in Margate, and um, I like the direction that uh, we're going in at the moment. You know, with some of the new developments, things like Turner, things like people from outside the area coming in and investing money to open shops and bars and and so on, and. Um, <clears throat> I'd like to see that continue. I'd like to see uh, a reopened uh, Dreamland, Lido, and so on. Yeah. Okay. If you had a favourite place in Margate, where is it and why? I can't really say that I've got a favourite place in Margate, one particular place. I enjoy walking around Margate and looking at um, the architecture. And uh, it's, all, it's all sort of part of nostalgia for me, but also part of the future. So, uh, yeah, not really, not really one particular place. Okay, and um, if the high, high street was to be uh, done up, what would you like to see there and why? I don't think the high street needs to particularly to be done up. I think we need to make it attractive for um, retailers to come in. Um, so that might mean lower rents, it might mean uh, lower business rates. Um, and I think the sort of businesses that we, we need in Margate High Street uh, would be something like Wilkinson's uh, in Ramsgate, uh, who I've been talking to for two years, trying to get them to come down here, um, and maybe a smaller um, local um, supermarket. That's the sort of thing that I think uh, would uh, help to reinvigorate the high street.